ADF was founded in 1961 as an industrial automation company. At that time, automation was clearly based on electromechanical components, since the electronic devices hadn't been invented yet. Over time, it developed mainly into three divisions – EPF Automation, EPF Energy and EPF Plastic. My father, who founded the company in 61, was already working with Siemens more than 40 years ago. When I joined the company, I already found Siemens as an important partner, so that we continued to develop this new line of business together. At the company, we have two persons dedicated to research and development since several years. The project we developed with Siemens is focused in particular on the possibility to apply deep learning and artificial intelligence in industrial automation. This has resulted in the evolution of the current services we offer, providing both cost savings for the customers and a degree of complex problem solving that would otherwise be completely impossible to achieve with the software and also required the continuous presence of human personnel. Based on this partnership and collaboration, we have succeeded in developing the innovative solutions we always strive to find and make available for the market, so that we are not continuously drawn into price wars and can instead focus on developing the relationship of mutual trust and collaboration with our clients. We are talking about one of our key projects that was developed together with Siemens, utilizing a technology based on neural nets, artificial intelligence, which on one hand was ported directly to the PLC by means of the Sematic S7500 NPU, Neural Processing Unit, where all the artificial intelligence operations were ported directly to the PLC through a module that connects directly to the entire range of Siemens standard equipment, and further provided with an outstanding degree of automation, which succeeded in resolving the issues we hadn't been able to solve for several years for our customers, and for which we often continuously found ourselves at a loss to find a solution. The development time has been quite fast, and the infrastructure for future evolutions is also extremely flexible, so that we'll be able to implement additional solutions for future problems. Our cooperation with EPF on this computer vision project applied to automation was strategic, because we were able to field test this emerging technology in collaboration with a company that has high competence in automation, as well as machine learning and edge computing. Sematic S7 1500TM NPU module is the first product that is already available in the market and capable of providing the benefits of artificial neural networks to the shop floor. However, Siemens' plan for the use of AI as a technology to serve industry is much broader. Our primary goal is to make the integration of artificial intelligence with automation simple, robust and reliable. Thanks to Siemens' new industrial edge, it is already possible to take advantage of the flexibility and scalability of edge apps, managed in the platform provided by Siemens or developed independently. The artificial intelligence features provided by the Edge apps enable the analysis of big data directly on the machine in order to detect predictively potential future issues, thus improving the efficiency of machines and of the entire plant, and hence productivity and energy efficiency. Wide attention has also been devoted to apps based on neural networks for image analysis and quality control, object detection, classification and integration into the area of robotics. As for future projects at EPF, we are developing robotics and AI applications in sectors other than our traditional industrial market, where we have the most experience, such as for example personal services and packaging. One example is beer tapping. We are developing with our leading partner for beer brewing sector an automated tap, provided with an AI system that operates the robotic tap based on the quantity of foam detected in the glass and the preferences of the consumer. All these technologies are based on a program leveraging a neural network, which is entirely based on both infrastructure components, in terms of the electromechanical parts and control, as well as state-of-the-art components from Siemens, which is what enables us to operate robots from different manufacturers and types.